I'm going to show you how to do our baiting for eel tail barbel. Eel tail barbel are one of the few fish that when the sea is bad it's the one fish that you can go and target and that's very important when it comes to competi competitive angling. So basically the trace is very simple. It's a double hook, circle trace, power swivel, anti-tangle free sleeve, soy hook, hair curler, very important that part there. Second hook, exactly the same, 304 um, tuna circle. Our sinker trace is slightly longer. We use very, very thick nylon. I'm using 080 here as my hook snooting. The reason being, eel tail barbel live in the rocks. And when you hook him, he tries to go for his hole. You can catch lantern fish fishing in the same area using the same baits. Um, speckles if you're up north, Zululand area. Lanterns, like I say, absolutely love his bait and we try to stay away from them. Eel tail barbel one doesn't have a lot of flotation in it. It sits on the bottom as best as possible. If you're targeting lantern fish, you want to put your bait up. Okay, just the two differences in the style of fishing that we're looking for. There's our standard hair curler, a little bit of Dacron on it, and the easiest way to do it is we take our Adcan prawn, white one, works very well, it's a very firm bait, easy way to do it. So take our prawn, cut him off, slice him from the back, like so, let's just grab another one quickly. Take that away, take that away. You can use crayfish as well for them. It works very well. I'll show you later on how to do a crayfish bait for them. Okay, just peel the white prawn. And white prawns as close, this white prawns as close as you're going to get to a crayfish bait. Okay, so let's do this. Okay. Very simple. Chocker hammer. And we hit it quite a lot to soften it up as much as possible. Take our latex cotton, take our prawn. Very simply bind it on as best as we can. Take two cracker. There we go. Okay. Tie the head and the pincers together. Bind it up, bind it up. Take our hook. Now my hands are very, very oily at the moment. There's the Dacron at the back. We just basically go straight through the Dacron and the tail. And there's the bait, all one. Simple as that. You can throw that as hard as you want and it's not going to come off because the hair curler actually holds the bait on. Let's just quickly get the whole trace together here. I'm just going to get another prawn. Again, hair curler side is what you're going to attach the prawn to. Take our cracker. Mm -hmm. 
And there's our second bait. Done. So basically, the whole trace will look like that. An excellent, excellent bait for catching eel tail barbel. Just to go through it, the top hook is 40 centimeters in length. The bottom hook is 15 centimeters in length. Both of the snootings are 080. And we use one mil between the two, just for abrasion resistance purposes. 16 kilo nylon for your sinker snooting. Because this is the part that you want to break off if you do get stuck in the rocks. That's the part you want to lose. You don't have to lose your whole trace because your sinker gets stuck. That hook will move around when the uh, eel tail barbel inhales it. You get him every single time in the side of the jaw. They've got a very, very hard jaw. If you use a J hook, chances of getting stuck is a lot greater. And the jaw is so hard in that eel tail barbel that he actually bends the point of your hook whatever hook it might be it just bends that whole point and i've had a lot of guys saying but hey i hooked the stumpy i hooked the stumpy it's not a stumpy it's that eel tail barbel actually crashing it you've got one of the strongest jaws and if you stick your finger in there believe me you'll never do that again that fish is an absolute pleasure to fish for you'll actually sit and if you're using braid hold your rod and you actually feel like a dunk on the rod and you go oh there he is and you'll feel a little bit of shaking going on and then a very slow pull and you just hold on tight start winding and you've got your eel tail barbel it's as simple as that and you can catch up to 20 in a session they're not difficult here we go guys simple as that eel tail barbel